Hey everybody and welcome to Big Pharma. Big Pharma. So Big Pharma's a game where you you make pharmaceuticals, you efficiently manufacture pharmaceuticals to sell and make a lot of money and it's kind of cool. I'm not very good at it but it's kind of cool and I want to show you the game because it's very, it's very interesting. So it's kind of like a cross between, in my head anyway. Have you ever seen the game Factorio? It's kind of like Factorio. It's kind of like City Skylines and it's kind of like Theme Hospital. It takes the Theme Hospital kind of jovial, quite comical side to, to medicine, but it's got the factorial kind of, you lay out train tracks and you know, all your, your manufacturing lines and stuff, you lay it all out and it's kind of city skylines and it's like a, you create things, you build, you take loans, you know, you research stuff, you gain more stuff as you go along, it's really cool and I like it a lot. I'm not very good at it though, because I'm not smart, but you know, it doesn't stop me from playing, it didn't stop me from playing city skylines, won't stop me from playing big pharma. So big pharma's a game by twice circled. And it's available for $20 at the moment, I believe. Um, I'll link the website below. It's not on Steam or anything, as far as I know. But you can um, you can pay for the game while it's in beta. And, uh, you know, play the game and stuff. If this is your kind of thing, if you like Factorio, I know a lot of people do. Uh, if you like kind of building games, games where you have to think with your brains. Games where you manufacture stuff, but with a lighter kind of edge to it. You know, th this is probably going to be a game for you. Um, so we're going to go new game. Now, what I've done is I've played through the all the tutorial stuff. You know, all the, you know, from Drug Production 101 all the way up to the advanced topic. So I know what to do. What I need to do is basically start here. The challenges, so you've got your beginner. You know, intermediate, advanced, quick start. Crippling debt. We don't want to do that. But beginner, you know, it gives you your map size, two by two. You've got one competitor and um, you've got a starting cash of 50,000. And it gives you some some details here of what you can do. So, in this one, bottom line, your your challenge is to earn total revenue of, I believe that's a million, looking at the zeros, <laughs> within 10 years. Your next one here, it's like, what, lost my appetite. Supply 300 appetite suppressant treatments within 8 years. And that kind of plays into the whole research, sending people out to discover new, new ingredients, new chemicals bringing them in, working out ways to create these things, and it's really cool. Um, you've got like a, a game of margins, attain operation profit of um, 150,000 over a 12 month period within 9 years. Aha, uh -huh. so there's a lot of businessy side stuff going on, I'm going to just do bottom line, earn as much money as possible. So company name, come on, let's go, we'll be big, Tams, pills, <laughs> I may be a drug dealer, who knows, and who is Big Tam be? Let's see, Big Tam, a heart, not with a heart actually. Oh, this is our, this is our chief executive, Orion. I don't trust him at all, but he'd make us money. He's a man that makes money. Barkley, Barkley's a man that makes money as well. I bet Tess would make more money than the rest of them, though. I like Leonard. He seems like the kind of guy that knows what's going on. Leonard, my friend, my bearded friend, come forth. So, shit to look at. There's a lot, right? So I pause the game now. We have one plot of land here. We can buy other plots of land around. What we have is we have terminals with which we can import chemicals and we'll build tracks to output chemicals to sell them, usually in pill form. We've got a couple of tabs at the bottom. We've got loans, which we can apply for, which I won't do. Make loans! Pardon? Make loans? Maybe we'll go for a make loan. Case the big make loan, please. Um, so we've got a production tab. This is basically our, you know, where we lay out our production lines. We've got ingredients. The ingredients tab will show you what chemicals that are readily available to you to import. So here we've got aromatic fer night spray. Uh, we've got this. <laughs> Whatever the fuck this thing's called is what we've got. We can upgrade it with shit. Um, but it tells you what it does. So it soothes cough with a side effect of induces nausea. I'll come into like probably side effects and effects and stuff later on, but it's quite complex. And then we've got the salty... Ferrixianide? Ferrixianide? Salty fairy residue we've got, and that uh, dries the mouth, but also calms acid reflux. We put things through a production line, and we can use different things, like this is the agglometer. Um, that will, that will of course upgrade this, this soothes cough by probably reducing? the concentration, but I'd need to actually check the machine. And over here, the evaporator. I think the evaporator would probably reduce the con- No, but no, no, that must increase concentration. What you want to do is that the the bar here is basically where the chemical sits at the moment, and you want to get it in like a kind of- it's, it's happy range, it's active range of 6 to 13. And obviously deciding on which one to go for. It's, it's hard, it's a trial and error process. Sometimes you maybe put like- For instance, if we wanted to decrease like three times, 
it might give us a chemical that's good, but if we decreased four times, it might be slightly better. But also, with changing that, we also, we also add, you know, to our induces nausea, that also becomes more prominent. And likewise, if we, hmm, well, I guess the dries the mouth would not be taken into account, but we might use the dries the mouth later. Anyway, this shows you the tab. We can also hire explorers that can either sit idly and gain our, um, our ingredient upgrade points, or we can send them off to, for instance, to the forest, where they can find, um, you know, whatever this thing is, the sting weevil, and it's used for blood medications, or, you know, the dragon beetle for sexual health. You know, big time, we'll make you a pill for a headache or a pill for an itchy undercarriage after a one night stand. Either or, I've got you, I've got you covered, don't you worry. Um, the vine borer, what are you doing, the body responses, you know, you, you get the idea. You send explorers off and they can do things. We might do that just now, actually. Well, why not? I mean, I'm probably going to run out of money and I'm never going to have enough time in this video to actually show everything. So what we do is we send our explorer off, we can click here to assign... Yeah, so everything else will usually take like two or four or five, you know, explorers. But this one takes one, so we can send our single explorer off. And the percentage will increase, of course, over time. Does that cost me 5,000 plus 50 a day for a goddamn explorer? And over time, we'll, we'll you know, research. We'll gain more areas and stuff. It's, you know, it, go, it goes on and on over time. And you can see charts. Lots of charts that, yeah, I'll hide that as well. Lots of charts that I ignore because they bore me to tears, but you know, they exist. Cures tab. Let's have a look at the Cures tab. The Cures tab will give us an idea of what we want to start with. So when you're looking at the Cures tab, you've got your, um, your, your two, you know, your, your two medicines that you can make. This is the Cam's Acid Reflux that would have been made with this fella here. And of course the other one, the one in the bottle would be the Sooth's Cough. We want to look at what's going to gain us the most money. So, you know, if we look at, say, for instance, this one, this will tell us there's sufferers, 2,169. We haven't supplied any, you know, but the net demand is 87%. And it's a cost of $99, I think, sale price is what that is. Or that could be manufacture price, I'm not sure. I'm honestly not sure whether that is, you know. Hmm, interesting. But this one has a net demand quite high. It's more expensive. I'm assuming that is to produce... But at the same time, what gives us the better, like, longevity over time? You know, do we want to go down the route of, eventually, we will create, you know, alleviate stomach ulcers from the cam's acid reflux. We can do that with that chemical, just by, you know, increasing our, our if making our production line better to make these chemicals. Or we can do the eases asthma. I think we'll go with this one just for, you know, a start, I suppose. And um, we've got a research tab. Where we've got all our fancy research things, we've got the evaporator we can upgrade, you know, what we can do is we can hire a scientist to just sit there. I think we'll hire a scientist and he'll just accumulate research upgrade points. And we can then apply those to machines to make the production, you know, the production line cheaper or, you know, pill bonus. I'd imagine that means that we can sell the pill for more money. I suppose, but this one here, you see that the process cost is reduced. This one process cost is reduced, and you know, every time you upgrade it will reduce the process cost. And him just sitting there, he'll accumulate these points. Which is fine. We've spent nearly 10 grand already on nothing. And then you can look at the company tab. Company tab has shit on it as well. Of course it does. The company tab. So here's the, our competitor, I think. Is it? Or is this... Ah, is, I think this is our competitor, maybe? I don't know. This is us, though. Big Tam's pills. Coming in, coming in big. Um, and I suppose we should produce some stuff. So... First thing we want to do is we want to give you a click and this will bring us to this page here and we'll decide what do we want to do? Do we want to do this one or do we want to do this one? Now if memory serves, this is the acid reflux, that's, is that the right one? I'll need to have a swatch. We wanted to do Sooth's Cough. And we want to do lungs, don't we? Aye, we'll do lungs, aye. So we're going to do this, this is the, the lungs, Sooth's Cough. So we want to import. Import that badger there. There we go. Okay. Now. So we want to use the aglerometer to give us a concentration of between 8 to 11. What are we on now? We're on like fucking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Well, how long is this bar? Hold on. I need to count. It doesn't tell you anywhere. I don't, I don't see the information that I need. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. We're on 14... 
but we want to we want to bring it down to eight to eleven. So when I'm fourteen, we want to bring it down to eight to eleven. Let's have a look at our our basics. Well, what we want to do first is we want to bring a belt out. Obviously, obviously, we want to do that. Oh, wait, we don't have this. Ah, we need to increase the concentration manually. I see. Okay, so uh, right, this is gonna, this is going to be a tough one. It's trying time. Uh, a piece of advice: don't click the belts, like click and drag. So click once, drag to where its destination is. Makes it way easier. You'll waste less money, you know, getting stuff done. That's one thing I found very quickly. So we're on. I'm not sure I understand. I'm doing this wrong. Hold on. I want to bring you down though. I fucked it. Fucked it already. Sell. Well, that's new. I fucked it already. I want. I want to. I, I want to decrease concentration. That's what I want to do. By three, I think. We'll try that. Let's see. So belt, belt me up, belt me up, and I'll uh, I'll swing this round here. And what we'll do is we'll just speed it up, and I want to see what happens to this as it comes through. This, this is where I struggle. You know, I lose a lot of money in the trial and error process. Ah, it's cool. That's, uh, that's what we're doing. The right way. Aye, aye. So it'll tell us when it's good. Are we good? Ah, we're good. So we can use this now as our as our soothed cough. Ah, that's the right one. You bring it down. But it also, of course, induces nausea. Right, so now we're in the right we're in the right area. That's good. What are you doing, Tom? You're pressing too many buttons. Now we wanna put them into pills, I suppose. Maker's pill printer. Or a creamer! We can make a cream for your undercarriage and a pill for your mouth. That's what we do. Um so what I'll do is I'll slap one there. And we'll bring the belt around. And I'll put it in there and it should export here. So when it comes through here, it should allow me to name the pill. Oh, I should also... Right. What we can do is we can add in a second pill printer here if we want. And kind of link it all up and it will all do its thing. Right. Show me the money. Show me the pill. Does it work? So what, what do we new product, what do we call it? Big chesty cough no more. The big chesty tam special is what we'll call it. The tam spe <laughs> Yes. There we go. And now we're making money. Now we're making money. So, you know, it's not the end of the world. While that's going on though, we should be taking we should be we should be having a swatch at our ingredients. Are we we're thirty four percent. What does this give us? Blood medications. It also has a catalyst. Catalyst is used for stuff used for things. But while we're doing this, we can um, go back to production. What I can do is I can eventually bring this off if I need to use this for, for, for a more strong medicine. Let's have a look at the, the cures, rather. Cures. So eventually we want the... Uh, no, 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 no. The asthma. So what do we need? The aglerometer? So that's basically what we're looking for. We want the eases asthma, I guess. So we'll be uh, we'll be looking to upgrade that. So we've got any research points? We've got one research point. Do, does that allow us to know we need? To... Oh wait, hold on. Oh yeah, I'll just assign you. That's right. I should have done that to start with. I'm losing track of what I'm doing. I should have done that in the beginning. But I can upgrade one of these. What am I using? I'm using these. I think I'm using a dissolver. I believe. Let me just go back to production. That is a dissolver. Maybe, maybe what I've done was smart, although it doesn't seem smart, because he should have been researching that since, like, the get-go, but we'll upgrade the dissolver, which means that the the cost to, to use it is reduced, I suppose. So it's only 9 rather than 10. We're doing stuff, we're making, we're, we're making pills, we're making magic cap, and it's good. People are getting their big Tam special pill, and it's fine. We could buy more land. I don't know, though. Our money is dwindling. We're, we're losing money at this point. We need to be earning money. So what I can do to earn more money is I can spend more money to make more money because that's what Big Tam does. What's this? Ingredients being found. We'll, we'll have a swatch of that later on, but what I'll do just now... Let's slap that in there. Slap that in there. Now we should be doubling our production. Hopefully. Pills. Pills on the rapid. There we go. Pills. Pills all day. Can we get in the green? Can you show me that money? <laughs> Are we doing double the amount though? I mean, I guess they've got a production cost as well and all that, but you know. 
Ah, oh, we're doing well. We're doing okay. It's fine. We're, we're losing a very small amount of money. I can I can live with myself. So this is usually about the point that I'm like a screaming bag of nerves. I'm like, I should be doing more. I should be doing more for the community and for myself. Oh, damn. I mean, we're getting there. We're, we're moving up. Right, okay. What's going on? So our competitor has um, released uh, another... Nah, fucking... Knew it. I knew they would. Let's buy another plot of land. Let's make another pill. I'm going to use this over here for something else for now. Oh! This is a uh, relieves hypertension with an ionizer. So it's upgraded. Hmm. But we want it in the active range of 6 to 13, I believe. Uh huh. Or we could go with. With this? I suppose. I suppose we should do this while it's there, you know. While it's while it's doing its thing. And we'll use the other chemical. So that, that I, again, this is like where it all falls apart for me. Because I have the best intentions as a. What do you do? Chemical. Um. So we want it 16 to 18, so we want to use the evaporator to boost its concentration. What are we on just now? We're on 14. Let's use this new device, this new fancy device, to immediately bring it up. Let's have a swatch at this. Perfect. That's what I want to see. Let me just bring it down here and it saves us a bit of space. Bring it round. And we will make it into a pill. No, we want it that way. Right there. Bring that sucker around. There we go. Now we've got two pills on the production line. And hopefully we don't run into problems. If we do, we can just take a loan, I suppose, is what we'll do. And we're just marching along. What, what have we got? What have we got? We've got the big acid away. Nah, it's, it's, not, it's not a good name. I think I'm a bit... Excuse me? Big Tams. Acid. Away. There we go. Now we're now we're thematically we're doing stuff. Let's see our money. Let's see money come in. Are we make money. We've got to spend money to make money. Do we have any research points? Um, we do actually. We just earned one. So what do we want to put that into? We could put it in the evaporator. We could put it in the agglerometer. What's going to help us with? Uh, actually, would probably be useful. Um, I guess we want to do the ionizer now. It takes three months to learn, but, you know, we're doing stuff. We're slightly... we're coming towards, you know. Hmm. Well, once we get the ionizer, I can I can get rid of these three, and then put one ionizer down. Hopefully it won't use too much money. 918... It might actually be more expensive to run the ionizer. It depends. Depends what we're gonna do. So let's have a swatch at the Cures tab. Again, this is when I'm starting to think, like, what the fuck am I supposed to do now? We want to do... We've got Soothe's Cough, don't we? Aye, so how do we ease asthma? You ask. Ah, then we use this thing. So let's have a look. Let's branch one of these off. Excuse me. There we... Yep. Yeah, yeah. Oh, balls. It does this thing. That really annoys me. Right, let's see how the, the machine looks. Aye, aye, aye. Good. Let's see what happens when it comes out. I just want to see. Because then if we can export it through here, then we've got we've got something better. So what have we got? Hmm. I've done it the wrong way. I think you need to bring it down and put it back up. <laughs> I've not done it correctly. Sell, sell it all, fucking... I oh, fucked it. Production's gonna stop for us. There we go, we're back on. This is the bit that confuses me. Oh, wait, hold on. Ah, you're fine though. You're doing well. Don't you worry. Hmm, maybe I'll branch it off from... Right, hold on. I'll try, I'll try this then. And see if this works. In my naivety. I hate it when it does this. Give me a corner piece. There we go. Right. Right, so it's in the right range. So now if I put it through the aglerometer, I think this is how you do it. Maybe, he says. Right, 
And then I'll do this. We'll see. Right, okay, so let's see. Let's see what it does. It's coming up big. We're running out of money drastically. I need to earn more money. We can take a loan, I suppose. Where are you? Right, now we need to... Uh, yes, treats... Wait, hold on. He's his asthma. So we need to bring it down by one, two, three... We need to bring it down four to ten. So one, two, three, four, five... Uh, yeah, so that's the, that's the range that it shows you. <laughs> so we need to bring it down by four. Or so. So I need the ionizer. I need that to be a thing. How long have we got till ionizer? Ionizer and a dissolver, I think. No, yes, yes. It can be done, I think. Do I have enough room to do this? Right, hold on. We're going to take a loan. Big time spells are going down the shitter. Bank McLoans. It's an expensive daily payment. The daily payment there's nuts. This seems like the most viable. It's got a higher interest rate, but it's over a longer period of time, and the daily payment's not as much. I'm thinking long term here, so Interbank, you're going to give us a... Okay, good. Now we can start getting some stuff done. Right. Buy this. I need to. So, sadly... I'm wasting money again, but it's wasting money to goddamn make money. I always say this. It's true though. I'm learning I'm learning more about the game now than I ever have before. Right, that's gonna pop out there. We can do some more stuff over here, but I want this to be our, you know, our thing. Right. So how long how long have we gotta wait for research on the ionizer? Oh, ten days! Okay. We're just gonna sit and patiently watch the research go on. We're watching research right now. This is the breaking edge fucking ionizing. <laughs> We're ionizing. There we go. Two, one, fucking case. The right, ionizer's in the bag. So this should work. We need to ionize. Hmm. Right, okay. Right, we want it to come in there. Right, it's not the cleanest of production lines. Right, ionize. I want, so, so, yeah, oh, no, it's good, though. It's good. And then I want, right, fuck, fucked it. I fu no, well, actually, that'll do. That'll be okay. That comes up there, right, and then we want to put it through one more, at least. We're trying to maximize space used. Is this going to be good for us? Oh, now we need to catalyze? With what? Oh, yeah, we've already... Wait, hold on. Oh, well, that's to upgrade? No, we're fine. We're not quite in the right range, though. We need to do... We need to do one more. Balls. I've been foiled. Well, that's no good to us. Hmm. I've run out of space. No, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Is it possible? Oh, fuck. I fucked it. Again, I fucked it. <laughs> th th this is basically how it goes for me, obviously. If you play the game, you'll probably be much better than I am. I would imagine. Let's do one of those there and one of those there. Right. There we go. Pop that in there. Right. Now do we have the right fucking level of niceties? Then we've got the catalyst we can get from the blood medicine. We don't want to upgrade to treat sprung I just want it to, to work. Maybe it needs to be down one more. It needs to be down one more than fucking... Oh, we've balls it up again. There should be more space though, right? One more dissolver. Right. Please work this time. Don't, don't keep me hanging here like a bloody idiot. Oh, fuck. Please work. No, it doesn't work. I'm gonna try and sell it as a pill. Let's see if it does it. What do you do? Do you sell? Can I sell you? Now I'm too advanced for my own good. Sell it! Oh wait, I've not pressed it into a pill. I'm a fucking idiot. Oh god damn. God damn. Tom's big pills are falling apart. Right, hold on. Hold, hold the phone. There we go. Slap that in a pill. Do you do anything? B 
break a chest, mate. Um. Yes. Does it earn me money? Let's see if it earns me money. It earns me money. I don't care. It does stuff. But how much is the production line, though? So let's see, three, 32, 35. I ain't worth earning money from that. From <laughs> big chest, mate. It's like you're shouting out at someone. Um, well, things are happening, I suppose. So I need to assign two to that. Hmm. Pardon? Alternative delivery. The creamer is really what I want. You know, if you're making creams, that's where you're at, right? Let's uh, try. Let's try and catalyze the the thing. How do we do this again? Let's think. So this is the the sticky tray fly distillate. Okay. So I want the I want this. This is the part that I want. Cause it's random fainting, but it's got the catalyst. You see. Hmm. Let's import. Let's import you there. And fuck it, we might as well buy this as well. There we go, we got a full house now. Right, we'll do, we'll do this, boom. And then, so what we're we looking to do? So what do you do? So we need a catalyst and a very strong concentration. Can I do that though? So how strong is the concentration here? Maybe I'd take it off of that one there, no. Right, if, if I could get this to come out of here. Hmm, mm-hmm. Is there any way to like run belts this way please? No? There is not. I haven't thought ahead. Um, I can actually. I can and I will. Possibly. Right. What was that machine? <laughs> what was that machine I just put it through? Um, it was... Was it one of these? For anyone that's played this before, they're probably cringing their head off. It wasn't one of these. Was it just a simple one of these? I think it was. No. What do I need to do with this bloody thing? I need to reduce it. Oh, it was an ionizer, was it? That doesn't feel right either. What have I done? Now I've forgotten my own process. So you need to be brought down. Hmm. It feels like what I've done is wrong. <laughs> feels like everything that I've done is wrong. Well, how the fuck did I do it before? Ah, I've done it like that, that's why. Aye, okay. Right. No, it'll work. I've, 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 I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking with my brain. And then... Aye. Yes. I think. Possibly. There's nothing over here, so it's not doing anything. So I, I want you to be... Right. So we need to put you through the... Mm -hmm. I don't want to remove you, though. I want to put you through the, the paces. So I think what I want to do is I want to increase... Oh, it's all a guessing game for me. Let's see how it comes out. So it comes out. But that's not quite what it needs to be. That's where it needs to be. I'm gonna put it through another one. Oh no, maybe that needs to be decreased though. Well, it increases that to the right range. Hmm. Again, Big Tam is out of his bloody. He's out of his gourd. He doesn't know what he's doing. He's confused by pharmaceuticals. Am I earning money yet? I'm, I'm, I'm losing money. I'll find pay. I don't know. I think I'll end the video here while I'm, st while I'm still semi, you know, I've got you, your attention still. 
It's a game by Twice Circle that's called Big Pharma. I'll leave a link for the website below. You can go and check it out. If you want to see other videos that are probably much better, you can go and check out Stejo, another fellow Scottish person who plays games like this. It's spelled, uh, his channel name is S T E E J O. He plays stuff like this in Factorio and other games that involve, you know, thinking, and he's good at them. It's very good. I'm not so good at them, so I'm gonna go now. But if you fancy the game you wanna check out, $20 available right now. You can play it, it's in a beta, and, um, you know, it is fun. I just suck at it.